Hello friends, I am Rahul and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this new video, we will be discussing Ansible Inventory. Let's start the video. Let's see the Inventory Basics. Inventory is a list of managed nodes on which we execute the action using the Ansible control node. The default inventory file in Ansible is located in the etc directory. The full path of the file is slash etc slash ansible slash host. We can add the details of the managed node in INI or YAML format. In this video, we are seeing it for INI format. We can add a single host or we can create a group to make the execution easy to manage. Let's see how to add a range of hosts to the inventory file. In the last slide, we have seen how to add a single host to an inventory file. But in case we have a list of hosts with the same pattern, then we can add the details of the host in a range. As shown in the image, we have entered a range of www servers from 01 to 50. Similarly, we can use a range for alphanumeric host names as well. Let's see the variables in the inventory file. Variables are the extra information that we provide related to the managed node. For example, Ansible connection, Ansible user or Ansible port if we are not using the standard port for the connection. These variables are also called as host vars. There are many more variables that we can use in the inventory file. These extra parameters are used by Ansible control node while executing the action on the managed node. One point which we should note here is these variables will override the default parameters. Let's see group variables. Group variables are used when we have a common variable for a group of hosts. It makes it easier for the administrator to replicate the same variable across the host without writing it multiple times in front of all the host name or IPs. To create a group variable, we need to write the group name colon vars in a square bracket. It means that these are the variables that apply to the group. The next question arises that what if we have to add variables for multiple groups. In the Ansible inventory file, we can create a group of variables for other groups as well. To do so, we have to create a group of multiple groups. As shown in the image, we have created a group of groups called Southeast. The word children means the group has other groups as its members. Post that, we can create the variables for the Southeast group. As shown in the image, we have created a group vars for the Southeast and added the above two groups in the Southeast group. Let's see external host vars and group vars. In the last slides, we have seen the host vars and group vars in the inventory file, but it is not mandatory to mention the variables in the inventory file only. We can create an external directory called host underscore vars and groups underscore vars to store the variables in a separate file. This makes it easier to manage the variables without editing default or customer inventory files. Thanks for watching the video. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel to watch more Ansible related videos.